Well, I am back from my trip to the west. I drove 4,281 miles from Petersburg, Virginia, through West Virginia to Kentucky, then what, Indiana, Illinois, Missouri, uh, Kansas, Colorado. I went to Colorado Springs, spent a couple days there toward the Air Force Academy, uh, the Garden of the Gods. Um, I drove up Pikes Peak. Uh, it was amazing, amazing trip. Uh, and then I uh, came down Pikes Peak and then went through uh, New Mexico. I drove into this huge storm that I could see from miles away. And it looked like a tornado, but I knew it wasn't a tornado. I was pretty sure it wasn't a tornado. Uh, and then I uh, went to uh, New Mexico. I'm sorry, New Mexico and then uh, the Panhandle of Texas, then to Fort Worth, had lunch with uh, a good priest friend of mine there, and then drove from uh, Fort Worth down towards um, Houston, where I have some family members, including some that are, are uh, a little bit sick, and I was able to visit them, a really wonderful visit with some family. And then I drove from Houston area to uh, Louisiana, from, and I, oh, Louisiana was pretty cool. I, I visited Lafayette, and then I went to New Orleans, beautiful St. Patrick's Church. I got some beignets uh, from, uh, what's the name of that? Du Monde, something, uh, Café Du Monde. Apparently it's famous, so that was really good. Uh, and then what else did I do? Uh, like Lafayette, then I spent the night in Mobile, Alabama. Uh, then I drove from Mobile to uh, through Alabama, to Georgia, to South Carolina. Stayed last night in Columbia, South Carolina. A uh, good pr priest friend of mine there, uh, just named the chaplain of University of South Carolina, so he's there. And then I drove from South Carolina today to right here in Petersburg. And in all of the sunset, the that I, one that I saw come uh, into Petersburg, and just unfortunately, but it was a beautiful, beautiful sunset as I was driving to Petersburg. I was like, man, that's probably the best sunset I saw the entire time. And I'm here in Petersburg at beautiful St. Joseph's Catholic Church. And I had this wonderful sunset to greet me. And, you know, it's, I'm sure you all saw it this evening as well. And then maybe the most fun, the, the, the happiest greeting of all that I could have ever had was the happy greeting that I saw when I was walking up to the fence walking up to go drop off my bags and what did I see peeking over the top of the fence were these wonderful sunflowers now when I left they were not like this when I left they were not as high you might have seen the leaves but there were no sunflowers there there are no flowers so look at that I get greeted by these wonderful sunflowers and I say to myself well shoot I should show everybody the garden update so that's what I'm going to do now that I'm back in Petersburg after my trip. I had a great trip, wonderful trip, and I go through it. If, you, if you're just joining us, uh, you know, I, I went through it all at the very beginning. You have to re-listen to it. But Father Brian did a nice job. He, he kept things watered, it looks like. You got a look at all these little tiny tomatoes, cherry tomatoes. Oh, my gosh. The garden's doing great. I come back. Oh, no. I had a red pepper. I wonder if Father Brian must have picked it. I have to check on that. Oh uh, man, and then all these, these flowers are doing great. It's just wonderful. But look at these. The sunflowers are huge. <laughs> look at all that. And <laughs> when they before they kind of blossom, they kind of look monstrous, these sunflowers. They look like some creature from the upside down, if you ever watch Stranger Things. Uh, yeah, I mean, look at this guy. Hello. And then I, we got these volunteer sunflowers that came up from the, the bird feed. I mean, look at all this. Look at all these sunflowers. And they're going to they're gonna start making some flowers. The salvia is doing great. Oh, my gosh. And I haven't been back here yet. Oh, another sunflower. There you go. Tomatoes. Look at that. And more sunflowers. Anyway, it's been a wonderful trip great trip it was it was just uh like you know burger i come back to petersburg um but i'm also gonna miss this garden i can't bring the garden with me i can bring all of you with me virtually you know i can i can uh 
you know, we can see each other online, we can see each other in person, but I don't think this big sunflower is gonna make the trip with me to Petersburg. Now, Father Brian said I might be able to take some of these uh, potted plants uh, with me to Peters, I mean, uh, to Williamsburg, but um, it looks like I got, I got disconnected for a second, uh, but um, anyway, I was just saying, saying that, uh, you know, it'll, it'll be, it's gonna be very sad for me to leave to say goodbye to all of you, but I'll, I, you know, and I can't bring this garden with me, uh, but we'll be able to still see each other. We'll be able to still, uh, um, you know, see each other virtually, see each other in person. When I come back, you come on to Williamsburg, say hi. I uh, would love that. Um, but um, I'll always have a place in my heart for this wonderful parish, for St. Joseph's Catholic Church here in Petersburg, for all of you, the people. Uh, and so, uh, but we still got a few more weeks uh, that I'll be together, that we'll be together. And I'm hoping to do some more videos of uh, the school uh, and uh, who knows, maybe even more updates on the garden. I don't know if we can top, I don't know if we can this. Uh, this guy is huge and it's doing its job. I mean, it's, I mean, it's blocking the AC. That's why I planted them there to block the AC units. You don't notice AC unit right there. You notice this huge, hugon, jugon, gigantor. <laughs> Gigantor uh, sunflower and all you know and his brothers over here or sisters. I don't know. So anyway um, God bless you all. Thank you for your prayers as I was on my trip I know many of you were praying for me praying for safe travels and you know I'm always a little bit nervous when I'm driving uh, but honestly the driving was was very uh, It was uh, easy. It was it was easy driving there, you know long straightaways of just uh, you know a lot of cornfields and and, uh, and uh, high plains and even the mountains, very beautiful, scenic driving. It wasn't very stressful at all. Uh, so it was a, actually a time, a great time for me to think and, and uh, process all the stuff going on. And so thank you for your prayers. Please continue to pray for me. Continue to pray for St. Joseph's Parish. Pray for all the priests who are going to be moving. Uh, Father um, James O'Reilly, who will be moving here especially. And uh, so thank you for your prayers. And uh, you all are in my prayers uh, every day. So God bless you all. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening. And I hope uh, I may be able to see you all tomorrow, um, maybe coming into Mass uh, or sometime. All right. God bless you all. We'll see you. Bye-bye.